Merry Christmas. <laughs> okay, Merry Christmas to you, Tauruses. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the month of December, Tauruses. And as you come to the second week in December, you are going to be having some third week in December. You're going to be having some luck because your sister sign is going to be vibrating. So I am... Um, I want to say thank you so much to all you Tauruses. Please like and share, share, share these videos. Thank you for supporting my channel and thank you for being here. Please remember to cross watch, cross watch. If you don't have enough money to buy a gift, you can always buy a gift for someone. So you can use the total download limb <laughs> link in this video. Um, and uh, you can send a 2020 reading for someone. I'm sure they will appreciate it sometimes you buy gift people use the gift and then it's over all right Taurus is whatever is happening I'm seeing a calling something is going to be happening this month of December Merry Christmas again enjoy your Christmas and enjoy the holidays so this month of December this um, it's a water month, an emo emotional month, and you're starting the month with an also an emotional. Now, this is a situation that has to do with a scorpion or some information that is going to be coming out. So for you guys, this month have four weeks. You have unexpected information that is coming at you, Tauruses. Unexpected information that is coming at you, Tauruses. We have the carousel in the second week. This is good because whatever the information that is coming in is going to be positive. It's something that you are waiting for. The energy of the Wheel of Fortune. Oh my God, no, it's not happening. But yes. Um, so Taurus is whatever is happening with the month of December. Go back and check out the on-demand reading, you Taurus. The general reading because the same energy of the carousel and the hermit is coming up in the third week so some unexpected information is going to be coming out for you Tauruses this is going to be good because what is going to be happening is that some secrets is coming out uh, the energy of the oracle so unexpected information could be coming out about you or about someone about you or about the issue or about a situation um, but whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing some unexpected news is coming in. So in the first week, you have um, news, breakthroughs, situations coming out. Second week is a fire week, the carousel, wheel of fortune. Of course, the carousel turn up in the um, month of Christmas. And then we have the energy of the hermit information secret some secrets that you were keeping or someone was keeping has come out so there we go whatever that has been happening and transpiring some secret that you were keeping some of you and um, unexpected luck is going to be coming in for some of you i'm seeing information and an alien spiritual alien spiritual energies is going to be coming out um, for you guys, whatever that was transpiring and happening, you're going to be finding out some um, things, some situation that is going to be transpiring. Okay, so that is going to be good. So again, there is a lot of emotion in this month for you, um, Tauruses. Third week is, uh, second week is looking good. But as it comes on to the um, third week, fourth week, especially in the last week, unexpected information is going to be coming out. So as we look at the first week going into the second week for you Tauruses, we have the eight of ones. A lot of information, a lot of information is going very fast. Whatever is coming out, the eight of ones, something about a Leo is coming out. So whoever you are and whatever is transpiring, something about a Leo is coming out, okay? some fastness so if you have a business first week going the second week it's going to be super 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 fast the quest of metal the quest of metal some investigation is happening tauruses so be aware of this the quest of metal is someone going on a quest trying to find out something okay someone going on a quest trying to find out something and this is definitely an investigation that is going on because someone is going on a quest trying to find out something. I am seeing a sharp thing and it has to do with a Pisces. Uh, um, it can be a Pisces, the nurturing. 
emotion it can be a Pisces okay so whatever information that is going to be coming out uh, this is the energy of a mother some of you could be dealing with a mother or some of you could be dealing with a psychic okay some of you is a mother and some of you could be dealing with a psychic now whatever it is if your mother is a Pisces is a Pisces or a scorpion that has passed away your mom is going to be helping you out now we have the four of pentacles the car soul is here it's going to be bringing you unexpected money and it's going to bring balance to your financial situation so the car soul is where the wheel of fortune is going to bring you money and this money is going to be coming in very very fast and it's going to bring financial stability in your world and that is going to be good okay financial stability in the world and that is going to be extremely extremely good so be aware of that um some of you are dealing with a capricorn a capricorn um and uh, I'm seeing information coming in about this app. I'm seeing you trying to protect yourself. Um, the seven of ones. I'm seeing protection. So I'm seeing secrets coming out, and you're trying to protect yourself, or you're asking for help to protect yourself. Okay. I am seeing that um, if you're dealing with a Capricorn. I'm seeing they are really there. They're very sacred. They very much know what is going on. Okay. I am seeing that your spirit guides are going to be protecting you. If you, and, and, and ex, if you have a parents or a wife that has passed away or parents or grandparents, I'm seeing them protecting you. So I'm seeing powerful angels are going to be coming down and protecting you. The direction a director of emotion is here so some of you are dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion okay so you if you are in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion whether a scorpion woman or a Pisces woman but it, it can be a Pisces woman but I'm seeing this person coming up as an Oracle I'm seeing that they're they are helping you through powerful um, uh, universal energies because I'm seeing that there is some negative forces that is coming at you and they're going to be protecting you so Taurus is be aware of what is just and is transpiring okay be aware of what is transpiring now I'm seeing a calling where some of you could be trying to communicate um, with a tar with a Capricorn but this Capricorn um, some of you you could be going to a Capricorn and a Pisces for Christmas I'm seeing that sort of a thing but what I'm seeing is that whatever this call is there's a lot of information that is coming out and whatever the information is is information where, where, where that has to do with a Capricorn and I'm seeing a Capricorn investigating something and a Capricorn is um, telling what exactly has transpired and a Capricorn is investigating something because what I'm seeing is that you're trying um, some of you are married to a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman it could be a scorpion woman and I'm seeing you an investigation is been t done against a scorpion woman because the energy of the hermit um, is where I'm seeing an investigation is trying to be done um, by a scorpion woman or it could be your your mother a mother figure is coming up but this person is an, is an oracle this person is really really um, powerful whatever it's transpiring this this person is going to be protecting you and uh, protecting you they're standing up and protecting you from out um the spirit world whoever and whatever is transpiring okay they're standing up and trying to protect you from out the spirit world there is definitely a lot that is going on and i'm seeing an investigation by you tauruses that is coming up investigating a leo i'm seeing um you're trying to pin a mother and this could be a scorpion woman this woman is 45 years and old but I'm seeing the Oracle. I'm seeing like their you their spirit guides is protecting them. You can't penetrate. Whatever you're trying to do, your their spirit guides is protecting them, and you can't penetrate what is happening. The outcomes is um I'm seeing that some of you are going to be connecting with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man. This person is going to really protect you from whatever negative influence that is coming in. 
what is the calling and what is the unexpected some of you are going to be receiving it finding out some information about a Leo and you're going to be protecting yourself some of you could be receiving some information from a Leo or finding out something about a Leo and you're protecting yourself some of you I'm seeing you trying to protect your financial stability because I'm seeing like luck is coming to you and you're trying to protect whatever you have luck is coming but you're trying to protect yourself and protect your information some of you are dealing with a Leo and a, Sag and a Sagittarian and some information is going to be coming out about a Leo and a Sagittarian whoever these people are there we go some of you are dealing with a young Sagittarian this person is in the reverse because a lot of information they're on the investigation and a lot of information is going to be coming out about this person this person is a young Sagittarius between the age of 18 and 45 they're on the investigation and for some of you is a young Leo and whatever the issue is and the situation is however you're trying to find, figure out something about them or someone else figure out something about them and is going to tell you the truth the hermit comes up twice ladies and gentlemen whenever the hermit in the in the week of Christmas the third week the hermit comes up twice the hermit and the Oracle twice the hermit 99 something is coming to an end 99 something is coming to an end there is an investigation that is coming um up on a scorpion woman okay so um yeah a scorpion woman now the oracle and the hermit double the energy so we have 99 double the energy we have another nine so we have three times nine um, Taurus is something is ending in your life in December get ready check out the full moon reading the Oracle is here she is showing up something about the mother your wife or a psychic person could be showing up something uh, but whoever the psychic person is they're not telling you whatever is happening the energy of this man this man this man is an um, Sagittarius man whoever this man is the eight is a Sagittarius man whoever the Sagittarius man is I'm seeing a young person trying to connect with a Sagittarius man and trying to create some situation and I'm seeing whatever is transpiring here the truth is going to come out because I'm seeing that some some investigation something that is happening because there is the quest there is the quest the quest is an Aries the or Sagittarian person and they are having a, a research being a, 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 an on the zook that is happening now who is this king of wands who is this king of wands um this is an Aries man and it has something to do with a Capricorn this is an Aries man and, and it has something to do with a Capricorn because I'm saying they're trying to figure out what is the connection with this Aries man and the Capricorn and whatever is transpiring I'm seeing this is very magical because uh, it's as if some of you want to figure out the connection between an and and an, an Aries man and a Capricorn but you know it's as if uh, um, people in, are like what the fuck leave it alone it's not yours so it's been blocked the information that you think you want to find it's been blocked I'm seeing this person walking away I am seeing that whoever this this person is is walking away so whatever is there there is there is a new um start um th there is a new start okay the seven I'm seeing that some of you are going to be protected. Some of you are standing your ground and protecting yourself and walking away. Some of you are standing your ground, protecting yourself and walking away. Whatever the issue is, the situation is, some of you are standing your ground, protecting yourself and walking away. Some of you, um, whatever this issue and the situation is, some of you are trying to figure out something with a Capricorn and a, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, but you can't get close to these people because uh, these people do not want 
to have anything to do with you. And I'm saying whatever you try at them, they're 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 not only spiritually protected, but they're also um, universal protected, and they're protected by laws, and you can't touch them. So whatever is transpiring, whatever investigation you can carry out, there is nothing that is going to come out because I'm seeing that people are just who they are. They don't have any secrets, nothing. They're just who they are, okay? There's no secrets and there's nothing. They're just who they are. They are like the oracle. These people are like pure, um, whatever is transpiring. So... Some of you are dealing with um, a scorpion um, where I'm seeing some information is going to be coming out. The scorpion, you're turning your back on the scorpion and you're moving forward. Some of you are standing the ground protecting your, um, uh, um, your, 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 your situation. You're protecting yourself. I'm seeing that a Pisces, uh, um, I said a Pisces, so it could be a Pisces that is going to be helping out some of you, but I'm seeing um like a pisces and a virgo is protecting a capricorn a pisces and a virgo is protecting a capricorn whoever this capricorn person is i say a pisces and a virgo is protecting this capricorn person but um a, a, a pisces of um a pisces a virgo and um a sagittarian is going to be protecting a pisces some of you are going to be protecting your yourself from a Leo. Whoever this Leo is, I'm seeing you protecting yourself from this Leo and you're walking away. It's as if you're a spirit, guys. If you're in a relationship with a Leo or so, I am seeing that the protection is coming up. So whatever is transpiring, a lot of you are protecting yourself from a Sagittarian person, whoever the Sagittarian person is. So they're trying to um, connect with you and to connect with you with a family but whatever is transpiring i'm seeing a sagittarian uh some of you could be returning in a relationship with a sagittarian so this is coming up check out your love reading for november and see if that comes in but whatever is happening with your financial stability i'm seeing that your financial stability is good it's being protected it's spiritually protected i'm seeing the spirit is holding you up and helping you to move forward so whatever that is transpiring i'm seeing spirit is holding you up and helping you to move forward i'm seeing that some of you is going to be choosing for a pisces cancer or a scorpion man um whatever it is there was a relationship or something like that i'm seeing you are definitely going to be um choosing to be protected and this person is definitely going to be, going to be protecting you whoever is in a relationship with a pisces cancer or scorpion um that has a child that as a child i'm seeing protection all right i was seeing that there is some clouds some clouds is hung in here and the clouds is hung in here and there is some situation where the energy of the clouds is hung in here over a pisces i'm saying a pisces but it could be a pisces cancer or a scorpion because they're not showing up who this person is so i'm seeing um the clouds hanging over as pisces for whatever reason i'm not sure okay so let's see what is happening so universal angels what is happening here all right unexpected luck is going to be coming in for some of you out there um some real unexpected luck is going to be coming in um for some of you out there if um you were dealing with a um an sagittarius person i'm seeing they're going to be bringing you some unexpected luck okay i am seeing the energy of the camera the the carousel this has to do with work protecting work but this is more of uh, a house is going to be returning to you whatever the lies and the deceptiveness is i'm seeing a house going to be returning to you okay i'm seeing the 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 carousel is the wheel of that is going to bring a house back to you because of something some deceptive thing that an aries leo or sagittarius have done with a house it's going to be returning to you i am seeing that some of you are going to be finding the deceptiveness and the people who hates you and deceive you and what exactly at transpire i'm seeing some of you are just definitely going to be finding out 
about people that has deceived you and whatever that has been happening okay I am seeing that some of you situation at work whatever the energy and the, the, the situation that is transpiring at work I am seeing some um, deceptiveness your intuition about your work is right on target your intuition about the um, a psychic um, it's like a psychic told you something um, you were right they were right a psychic told you something but some of you something about your work some lies and deceptiveness about your work is going to be coming true and you're going to be seeing this okay um, as I'm doing this there's negative forces and negative energies so some of you might be feeling prickle stab in your back and that sort of a thing is someone sending you negative energy so if you have like sharp stabbing in your back your head or so is someone sending you negative energy okay there's a lot of lies and jealousy a lot of lies and jealousy okay so I'm seeing some clouds that is coming up. I'm seeing some clouds that is coming up. I'm seeing deceptiveness. And let's see where this jealousy is coming from. Let's see where this jealousy for the Taurus is, is coming from. Because there is some jealousy. I've got to see. Because 99, 3 times 9, something is coming to an end. Okay, some of you were dealing with... Uh, an investigation because that's the quest the quest is an investigation where um, someone was trying to investigate something but I'm seeing you're going to be be very protected and you're going to be moving away from something so this jealous this jealous jealousy can be people who jealous or jealous of what you have yes the energy of the devil you're leaving a situation behind and you're going to be winning okay so if you were divorcing um, a woman that is a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion, because I'm seeing the mother and the child comes up, you could be dealing also with another family. And you're going to be finding out that there's uh, there's a lot of lies and jealousy that is coming on. A lot of lies and jealousy, and it's all coming out now. The energy of the hermit twice is showing you and letting you know a lot of deceptiveness, lies and, and deceptiveness. And it has to do with the children of your mother. It could be the children of your mother because your Taurus is the children of your mother. Um, it could be your mother. But there is some deceptive situation that has been happening, especially at work. If you're doing psychic work, you got to be careful because I think that people are not honestly paying you what your worth is. Or people are taken from you so whatever this is okay and as I said it I get like three sticks in my in in um, and you know and this is so sick and a lot of people stupidity not everyone people can use negative energy and hurt you know and that sort of a thing so I'm seeing the end of a deceptive situation the truth is coming out the end of a deceptive situation the truth is coming out i'm seeing the move to more positive alignment energy i'm seeing the energy of work and people at the work floor and that sort of a thing the deceptiveness um that is transpiring i'm seeing um uh this is the end of lies and deceptiveness and you're standing up and you know just walking away from something and just because you're going to be overcoming a situation with a scorpion woman okay whoever the scorpion person is you're going to overcome a situation with the scorpion woman i am seeing um the um, unexpected news um is coming up from a sagittarian person a sagittarian man 45 years and older some unexpected news is going to be coming up about this person okay so that is really really good okay so um news if you're planning on buying a house it's going to be good so um uh, that is that is just really wonderful and positive the desert prince survival false promises be careful of false promises the desert kid be false promises are coming up 
um, in this month, you Tauruses. False promises. Do not listen to these promises. There are false promises. Anyone call you, promise you anything. It is false promises. Whatever the issue is, situation is, false promises. Lies. Do not believe these false promises that is coming up. Okay? Don't believe false promises. So, when you stumble upon the desert prince, you receive a gift. The planet and life forces in the, in the desert environment is well defined or tough and rough places that you have to go through. No water, dry spell. In spite of external condition, um, and extraordinary life forces that is changing, be tough, have courage, and dare to dream no matter what circumstance it, it may be. Whatever hardship you're going through, Taurus, is, you will survive, okay? You will thrive. In spite of conditions, you will succeed. Dry spells are also true tests of faith and courage. Expect nothing less than what it is in your most precious dreams and watch miracle manifest. Whatever the, uh, the situation is, whatever that brings is you need to be in your survival mold. Um, you Taurus is in the month of December. Survival mode is the only thing that is going to help you. Ladies and gentlemen, I love you guys. Um, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I will speak to you. This is the last reading of the year 2019. And I want to say to each and every person, go back, check out who is the Sagittarian person. Oh, it's the Sagittarian person. And I want you to understand who we are and please like and share it in the first week expect unexpected luck that is going to be coming in unexpected information i love you guys namaste until next time